Tuesday, June 25, 2024. Tuesday of the twelfth week in Ordinary Time. First reading. A reading from the second book of Kings. Sennacherib, king of Assyria, sent envoys to Hezekiah with this message. Thus shall you say to Hezekiah, king of Judah, do not let your God on whom you rely deceive you by saying that Jerusalem will not be handed over to the king of Assyria. You have heard what the kings of Assyria have done to all other countries, they doomed them. Will you, then, be saved? Hezekiah took the letter from the hand of the messengers and read it. Then he went up to the temple of the Lord, and spreading it out before him, he prayed in the Lord's presence, O Lord, God of Israel, enthroned upon the cherubim. You alone are God over all the kingdoms of the earth. You have made the heavens and the earth. Incline your ear, O Lord, and listen. Open your eyes, O Lord, and see. Hear the words of Sennacherib which he sent to taunt the living God. Truly, O Lord, the kings of Assyria have laid waste the nations and their lands, and cast their gods into the fire. They destroyed them because they were not gods, but the work of human hands, wood and stone. Therefore, O Lord, our God, save us from the power of this man, that all the kingdoms of the earth may know that you alone, O Lord, are God. Then Isaiah, son of Amos, sent this message to Hezekiah, Thus says the Lord, the God of Israel, in answer to your prayer for help against Sennacherib, king of Assyria, I have listened. This is the word the Lord has spoken concerning him. She despises you, laughs you to scorn, the virgin daughter Zion. Behind you she wags her head, daughter Jerusalem. For out of Jerusalem shall come a remnant, and from Mount Zion, survivors. The zeal of the Lord of hosts shall do this. Therefore, thus says the Lord concerning the king of Assyria, he shall not reach this city, nor shoot an arrow at it, nor come before it with a shield, nor cast up siege works against it. He shall return by the same way he came, without entering the city, says the Lord. I will shield and save this city for my own sake, and for the sake of my servant David. That night the angel of the Lord went forth and struck down 185,000 men in the Assyrian camp. So Sennacherib, the king of Assyria, broke camp, and went back home to Nineveh. The Word of the Lord. Responsorial Psalm. Let our response be, God upholds his city forever. Great is the Lord and holy to be praised in the city of our God. His holy mountain, fairest of heights, is the joy of all the earth. Response. God upholds his city forever. Mount Zion, the recesses of the north, is the city of the great king. God is with her castles, renowned as he is a stronghold. Response. God upholds his city forever. O God, we ponder your mercy within your temple. As your name, O God, so also your praise reaches to the ends of the earth. Of justice your right hand is full. Response. God upholds his city forever.